definitely it's one of those cool Corps of Engineer uh, projects that you go to and you're like, wow, this place is, this is unique. Then when I found out about the history of it, you talk about something that really ties together multiple stakeholders and like almost the, the birth of, the, the, of what we do in the Corps of Engineers. Of course, you've got the power plant there, so we're producing power. But how, why we got there, unlike it's pretty unique to the core, but we don't own the reservoir. We don't own the lake. We don't own any of that. And what basically happened was because we also have the dredging mission of keeping the, 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 heart, the navigation waterways open. Um, when this was really originally, uh, when the, the lake was originally built, uh, the water, which used to flow up on the uh, on the Santee side, it used to have a lot more flow rate there and less flow rate on the Cooper side. And what that meant was is that the water flowing down into the harbor, you had less sediment build up and we didn't have to, to dredge as often. But what we ended up doing is building that power plant there really as a side effect of re-diverting water back over to the Santee so that we don't, we save money on dredge. But when we did that, you have a bunch of different fish that would use that to, to swim upstream and spawn into the lake. So now we gotta figure out, okay, well, how do we get these fish back into the lake? Well, that's where we work with our uh, Department of Natural Resources for South Carolina, and we created this fish lift, which uh, it's really cool to the point where you can actually see the lift go up and the fish, and there's a, there's a whole section there. It really shows the environmental piece that we do. It shows the dredging aspect. Now we're running a power plant. I mean, it's it's, it falls in line with a lot of the things that the, the Corps does. Uh, you know, which brings me to the, you know, post 45. We're, we're making in the harbor even deeper now, which is already uh, shown to have very, uh, very great economic benefits. I think the port is doing more business than they ever have before. So uh, with what we've done so far, and we still have a year left on that project. Um, also super excited that the Crab Bank, our beneficial use, um, we were able to kick that off. So, uh, you know, this spring, hopefully we'll get to see some birds returning there and, and as we move forward. So talk about some exciting times.